dreams. Dreams, even the most ludicrous, can be significant. But we must search far deeper, look much closer than what meets the eye. If we are to surface and truly live, To somebody else? Perhaps another Frankie? Oh, no, no, baby. You all right, dude? Oh. I was having a dream. Must have been one hell of a dream. You've no idea. Your folks just left. They uh, left this for you on the fridge. Remember what we talked about. You're an adult now, and you'll be the man of the house while we're in Europe for the summer. This is our way of showing you that we trust you. So remember, son, we're counting on you. And I'm counting on you too, Frankie. Don't forget to walk Fluffy twice a day. And leave the back gate open for nachos so we can do the garden on Tuesdays. And there should be enough food in the fridge to last you. And if you need anything, remember. They're gone for the summer. You're an adult now. And the man of the house. They trust you. I must be responsible. No parties. No booze. No women. Not. In every room, I mean, this guy's got a fine chick in his bathrooms even that'll help him shave in the morning. It's the life, man. Oh, yes. Where do you get that? What? The beer? You got it from the bar, didn't you? Hey, bro, by the time your folks get back, the fridge will be restocked and labeled. No worries, man.
So what's up with you and Dee Dee, the Ice Princess? You still trying to pry her bra? I don't want to talk about it. She still hasn't given it up, has she? Bogey. I said I don't want to talk about it. All right. All right. It's just that these days, girls who aren't giving it up are usually holding out for marriage. You know what? I'm out of here. Hey, Frankie. I'm sorry, bro. Did you hear that? Yeah, what the hell was that? I don't know. Let's get out of here. Might be some kind of psychotic seagull or something. Wait, 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 It's gone. It's gone. Oh, man. What the hell was that? I don't know, man. Some kind of flying fish, maybe? Your neck is bleeding. What? Whoa! I'm cool! Oh, man! Oh! If I ever get that damn... Whatever it was, out. Where'd you come from? Something attacked me, and, uh... I, I, I swam the shore as fast as I could. Really? Something just attacked us two from the air! It bit me! Oh, let me take a look. What are you, a doctor? No, 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 but I know a lot about bites. Oh! Okay. Huh? Well, you're lucky. Yeah? You're lucky. It's nothing serious. Just a scratch. You're gonna be all right. Eric Von Zippo. And my friends call me Moondog. And you are? This is Frankie. And I'm Bogey. Frankie and Bogey. Uh-huh. Hey. hey, it's a pleasure to meet you both. Hey. I got a fire going over there, right? Just, 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 just past that dune. Maybe you guys like to join me. Uh, listen, uh, Moondog. Uh, it's getting kind of late, okay? And we really have to get going. Don't tell me you guys don't party. Please! Man, we party hardy! All right. I got some of the hottest, most righteous babes that you ever saw sitting right over there on my beach party. All right! All the babes! We're there! Cool. Let's go. Bogey? What about the concert? What concert? The Kiss concert. It's tonight. Remember? So? No dinero, man. I'm broke. I don't already have the tickets. It's your birthday present. My birthday's in February. So I'm early. You want to go or not? Sorry, man. Just rules. Later. Hey. How about after the concert? Hey! Yes! You can bring the chicks by later. Frankie's got plenty of room. He's got the whole house for the summer, man. We can all party together for as long as you like, right, Frankie? Yeah. The house is just up the street on the left. 156 Lobster Lane. You can't miss it. Oh, we're done. Don't forget to bring the babes, okay? Hey, come on, of course. All right. Hey, they'll be anxious to meet you. Likewise. Be there. Aloha. Later, Frankie. What are you thinking? What? You get the guy my name, my address here, give him my keys, let him move in? You know what? You're too paranoid. Man, you worry about everything. You gotta lighten up, dude. Let your guard down once in a while. Now I'm telling you, meeting Moondog is probably the best thing that ever happened to you. You watch. He's a cool guy. You act like some kind of wacko. How do you know he's not? Because he's got babes with him. Wackos don't have babes. You ever hear of Charles Manson? Oh, wait. You think Squeaky Fromm's a babe? Not hardly. Anyway, I guess we'll find out after the concert, won't we? Bogey, I have to tell you something. What? I don't have tickets to the Kiss concert. What do you mean you don't have tickets to Kiss? You just said you had tickets to Kiss. Why don't you have tickets to Kiss? It's the only thing that I knew I could say that would make you not go with that guy. What? Why didn't you want me to go with him? He had babes over there. What the hell's your problem? What, you can't get it up? Is that why Dee Dee ain't making it with you? Can you ever just drop something and let it go? Hey, Frankie, I'm sorry. You know what? Just don't say anything, okay? Shut up. Look, man, I, I was just kidding. I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry. Look, the least you can do is forgive me. I mean, I forgive you. 
You know how I feel about Kiss. That was a pretty cool trick. Amigos? Amigos. Let's just All right. get out of here, okay? Hey. What time do you think those chicks are showing? Shut up. Where'd you learn to howl like that? Where are you going? Fluffy. Where are you going? What are you doing, huh? Anybody in here? Don't come any closer. I have a trained attack dog and he can rip your throat clean out if I tell him to. Mm. Well now, we wouldn't want that, would we? Well, then we'd have to clean all that sweet red blood off. I'm warning you. Oh, Frankie, Frankie, Frankie. I seen you've forgotten me already. 
But I haven't forgotten you. Forgotten what? Who are, who are you? Oh, how quickly they forget. Unfortunately, I remember everything. Remember what? I don't even know what you're talking about. Well, the mind can certainly become clouded over time, can it, Frankie? But not mine. You see, I recall the words exactly. You said, and I quote, we can all party together for as long as we like. Don't you remember? It's me. Moon Doggy. we met on the beach. Who? Who? Moon Doggy. I don't believe this. Uh, now, wait a second. You did say there was a party, didn't you? Hmm? Oh, Frankie, great place you got here. Yes, very impressive. Although much too many windows, yeah. We'll have to do something about that. Oh, this place will do nicely. Very nicely indeed. Very nicely indeed. Now, you did say it is yours for the summer, right? I mean, no pesky parents around or anything. Look, uh... Moon doggy! Oh, this place is perfect. Yes, oh. Looks like you have plenty of room for all of us. Oh, don't worry. Uh, we won't be in the way. We? Yeah, well, chances are we'll be leaving soon anyway. Like how soon? Well, perhaps a few... Hours? Uh, Frankie... Listen, it is so good to see you again. I mean, we got a lot of catching up to do. We do. Yeah, I mean, a lot's happened since we last saw each other. The police came, they threw us off the beach. Oh, now we need a place to stay. <laughs> anyway, uh, we could talk about that later. But first, uh, I got a little surprise for you. Don't move. Stay right there. Another one. This one. This is going to be good. No, don't even breathe. Shh. Please. No, this is going to be good. I don't French. even know you. Just wait. Just look. Ready? Show me, kid. Stay here. Of course we'll stay here, darling. How nice of you to offer. Frankie, this is Katrina. Katrina. Frankie. I'd like you to meet Sulka, my other friend. Pleasure to meet you, Frankie. Uh, now about uh, some sleeping quarters, hmm? maybe? We just flew in from Frisco? Uh, let me guess, your wings are tired, right? <laughs> <laughs> Very funny, Frankie. Very funny. Yes, Frankie, that's charming. Moondoggy didn't tell me how witty you were. Well, I'm only witty half the time. Yes, that makes me a half wit. <laughs> you are just delicious. Fluffy, D down. Stay. Frankie, Frankie, Frankie. It's, it's quite all right. We like dogs. Especially little fluffy dogs. <laughs> no, wait, Frankie. No, shh, don't, don't even worry. These, everything's all right. They're very protective of me. It's almost embarrassing. <laughs> Uh, now, we need to get some sleep. Sleeping quarters. Maybe. Please, <laughs> down. Calm down. Whoa, whoa, hey, Frank. Uh, no, on? no, everything is fine. It's just, uh... Whose room is this? This is my parents' bedroom. Yeah. Okay. There's just two of the rooms that I'd be glad to show you guys. This is gonna be fine. No problem. Come. It's okay. Yeah, you guys no, 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 you're okay. There's two other no, rooms. No, this is good. Like, like I'm to show you guys. Girls! Frankie, Frankie, that room will do. Yeah, but that's my parents' oh, bedroom. Oh, it's so kind of you to offer it to us. But I didn't. No, ch 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 yeah, but I... but, but wait. Now. Now it's time to say goodnight. Frankie. Good night, Frankie. Sweet dreams, my new friend. Katrina. Okay. Sulka. Sulka.
I just let three total strangers sleep in my parents' bedroom. <laughs> oh, hi. What a nice little doggy this is. Is he yours? Or uh, is he uh, fair game, huh? <laughs> Who the hell are you? Oh, I'm, I'm Bruno. I'm the new kid on the block. Bruno? You leave the nice, fluffy, doggy alone. Do you understand? Yes. Oh, God, you're hurting me. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, Frankie. Okay. Frankie, this is, uh, this is Bruno. He's, uh, he's a friend of the family. Yeah. Friend. Good friend of the family. <laughs> Look, Moon Doggy. This is getting a little out of control, okay? Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Don't, 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 don't even worry about Bruno. He, uh, he sleeps outside. I mean, he's, uh, very fond of the, uh, the great outdoors, aren't you, Bruno? Oh, why do I always have to be alone? And... I'm here. Oh, yes. Yes. I, I love the outdoors. I mean, there's so much more to do when to, to eat. <laughs> now, uh, Bruno, go and uh, get, get our things. But, yeah. Uh, Quickly! Count, yes, Count. But no, can, no, no, it's yes. almost going to be dawn. But just, can, no, no, please, Bruno! But I have to go pee. Go! Frankie. Thank you. So much, my gracious host. What? Okay. Yes. Just take a look. Just I'm doing complaining. the best I am. Just stop complaining, okay? I'm doing the best. All your life you complain. This is up. heavy. Shut up. It's heavy. Just push. Push. <coughs> Listen. Push. All right, Count. Okay. Nighty-night. Don't let the little bed bugs bite. <laughs> I must be dreaming. Can I help you? You're bleeding. Yeah, so it's just a little cut. D does it hurt? No, no, what the hell do you want? Oh, nothing. And I, I, I just wanted to know if you wanted some breakfast. No, thank you. It's the most important meal of the day. Will you please get out of here? Good morning, sunshine. 
What have you done with my kitchen? Oh, don't worry, I'll clean it up. It's no biggie. Carry me back to a trans. What are you cooking? Mmm, it's delicious. You want to have a taste? I'll pass. You'll be sorry. You don't know what you're missing. Hi. Oh, Dee Dee. Oh, thank God. Where'd you find him? He was just in the driveway. Why? Did you lose him? Yeah, come on in. And then I told Amber that we'd meet her and go to the beach later on, so I think we should. Oh. What's that awful smell? I don't know. Uh, Dee Dee, this is Bruno. Bruno, this is my girlfriend, Dee. Trey Charmo, I'm sure. Yeah, well, we've got to be gone. Oh, don't you want to try some of my my specialty? What is it? Oh, it's from my kosher recipe book. I call it uh, Persian Delight. Yeah, I'm sure it's great, but um, we're going to be getting something out, okay? See ya. Oh, well, ciao. Who was that guy? Uh, it's a long story. I'll tell you later. You're a bright, luscious young lady. Do you mind? I'm trying to prepare for my role. I just had this really great audition over at Warner Brothers, and out of a hundred girls that were there, of course, I snagged the role. And the best part? Oh my God, you'll never guess. Guess who all my scenes are with? Guess. I don't know, Gary Coleman. I was with the weirdo in your kitchen this morning. Me and Bogey met them last night at the beach. Them? You mean there's more of them? You know what, Carrie, let me help you. Hey! You only say one thing. They're still doing rewrites. Where were they living before that? Uh, I think just somewhere along the beach. Uh, they seem all right. Yeah, well, you're here, you're here. Ah! Let an expert. That was the men's freestyle tanning champ last night. Okay, I'll let you do my back. I hope they don't stay too long, though. What? Well, my parents are out of town all summer, and I thought maybe you and I could spend some time at your house alone. You know, just the two of us. Really? Ah! <gasps> You're such an idiot! Oh! Oh! I, uh, better go see if she needs help cleaning up. Hey, wait for me, dream woman! Hey, go easy on her, okay, Bogey? In the past, European vampires preyed upon those living in castles cottages and places like that. But American vampires, <laughs> they prey upon those who inhabit nightclubs. The lowlife, the scum, all those yucky people.
You should have seen my friend Tony's face when he found out I was coming in with you two chicks. He totally freaked out! I'll bet he did. You should have asked him to come along. The more the merrier, Rick. Hey, 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 no way. Because I ain't sharing you two chickies with nobody. You know what I'm saying over there, big boy? I just came here to watch you, Rick. Hey, well, you know, that's kind of kinky, but uh, hey, whatever floats you about there, weird boy. After all, this is L.A., and in L.A., anything goes. That's right. Anything goes. Oh, okay. That's right. Uh, this is so funny. Hey, oh, you like this stuff, huh? Ah! 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 some leftovers and I fell asleep. I must be loose now. Oh no, not you. Maybe you're just having a bad trip. <laughs> Vegetable juice? You mean to tell me people actually drink that stuff? So you haven't seen any of them since they moved in, except for this Brenner. Well, it's like I thought I did, but now I'm thinking it, it must have been a dream. It was a dream. Hey, these babes are really hot, huh? Yes, they are hot. But they're kind of scary. Do you mean like, uh, kinky? Scarier. All right! Where can I meet him? I don't know. You know, always asleep during the daytime. I never see him at night. Besides, I want to get rid of him. Didi says she wants to come over and spend some time alone. Finally! Yeah, no kidding. You should hold off just to see if these older babes come across first. Then you'll be more experienced with me. If you uh, catch my drift, virgin boy. Who's talking, monkey spanker? Chicken choker? Willy Wacker? Pecker puller? Hot dog handler? Hot dog handler. Man, that sucked. <laughs> hey, 
Maybe I talked to the big kahuna about this. He'll probably tell me I'm crazy. Have you ever talked to him before? No. Have you? Sure. Maybe I'll put in a good word for you. Beautiful, huh? The cop taught it to me. What the hell is all this? Oh, you're right. I'm not done yet. Oh, my gosh. Look, you little tapeworm. These are my windows. Oh, please don't. Please, I'm begging you. Let me do my job, please. What do you mean? Do your job. Oh, yeah, you... If I don't block out that sunlight, he, he's very allergic to it. He'll break on in a terrible rash. Oh, please. What the hell are you talking about? Count Eric. Who the hell is Count Eric? Count Eric von Zipper. Oh, excuse me. You know Mr. Moondoggy. Uh, he gets very ugly if he doesn't get his way. Oh, yeah? Um, well, I can get ugly, too. Please, where are you going? I'm going to go talk to Count Moondog. Oh, no, I wouldn't do that if I were you. <laughs> oh, yeah, why not? He needs his beauty sleep. Oh, please, don't, don't. No, don't. No, I'm telling you. Oh, no. Hey, Moondog, you open up. I want to talk to you. Well, it's not a good idea, believe me. Oh. Hey, Count Eric, Moondog, open the damn door. <laughs> Sleeping. <laughs> we'll see about that. What are you going to do? No. Don't do it. Where are you going? No. Oh, the count's going to be very pissed. Shut up. You people come into my house, think you can just take over? Well, I got news for you. Where are you going? Ah. Uh, I got a roast in the oven. Roast? And my dog better be okay. You hear me? Cannibal? in the bedroom. Bruno? Bruno? Oh my god. Fluffy. Fluffy? Fluff? <laughs> Fluffy? <laughs> Fluffy?
Bruno, what the hell is going on? You know, I feel so nervous. I had to come down here and make something to eat, a little nosh for myself. <laughs> That's not what I'm talking about. Those coffins in the bedroom, where do they come from? Oh, that. <laughs> they came from Queens. They belong to the Count. I don't care who they belong to. Why are they here? Well, the Count takes them wherever he goes. They, they've been in the family for years. drink or something? Uh, maybe. Uh, but can I ask you a really, really off-the-wall question? Of course you can. You can ask me anything. Are you sure you're not going to think I'm freaking out? I already think you're freaking out. Now, what's the question? All right. Here goes. Do you believe in... Vampires? What? Vampires. Blood-sucking freaks. I'll be right back. Where are you going? To get you something to drink. I'm worried about you. You're acting really strange and talking about vampires? Look, I'm telling you, Didi, I don't know what's happening to me. I think I'm hallucinating. There are no such thing as vampires. Right? Right. I mean, you don't believe in them. Do you? Of course not. There's no such thing as vampires. Now, come on, please, drink something. Frankie, wait, what's going on? Look, I gotta think. I'll call you later, okay? I just gotta figure out some things. Wait a minute. Figure out what? How I'm gonna get those damn vampires out of my house. I can't believe I'm doing this. Vampires. 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 Um. Uh, uh, no. No. What about the occult? Uh. No. Sorry. The supernatural? No. Sorry. Well, 
thanks for your help. Dr. Ludwig van Helsingmeister's automated answering service. If you're pestered by polar guys, press one. If you're worried by werewolves, press two. If you're certain it's Satan, press three. Come on, come on. If you're victimized by vampires, press four. Hello, this is Dr. van Helsingmeister. Doctor, listen, you gotta listen to me. I'm sorry, I'm not in. Take two cloves of garlic and call me in the morning. You gotta be kidding me. Afraid not. If this is an emergency, leave a message and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. If you're still alive, of course. <laughs> uh, uh, doctor, hello. Uh, uh, my name is Frankie. And, uh, I think I have vampires in my house. Um, I'd like to get rid of them as soon as possible, so. If you could please call me back at 555-5230, um, five, 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 I would greatly appreciate it. Uh, thank you. <laughs> Bye. You know, they're so much better eating when they're live. Damn, there goes lunch. Then again, <laughs> maybe not. <laughs> Transylvania 65000. Who? Doo doo? Oh, Dee Dee! His girlfriend Dee Dee. Yes, I remember. What? No, 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 Frankie. Ain't here. No, I, I don't know where he is. All right, I'll tell him when he comes in. Yes, I'll be sure. Okay, bye bye, Dee Dee. Pets are us? Yes, sir. Okay, I do it for you. Uh, listen, do you deliver? Mm -hmm. Yes, we do. You do? Good. Listen, can you send over right away a, a large spotted guinea pig? Uh, yes, we can do that for you. No problem. Yes, to go. Yes, we'll right. And uh, make it potty trained. Thank you. Frankie. How you doing? You okay? Let me tell you something. I had a tough day. You don't even want to know. Oh. 
Are you okay? Fine. Something's wrong. You can talk to me. Come on. You think I'm in your life by mistake? No, I'm here for a reason. Now, when I'm a person's friend, I come through. I come through for that friend, and I want you to know that. Just a second. Hold on. Hello? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's great to hear. Yeah. No, this will be great. Bring her. No, I'd love to see her. Yes. Perfect. Good. Bye-bye. Frankie, I want you to be straight with me right now. Something's wrong, and I want you to know you can trust me. Now, come on. Just trust me. Just trust me. I care about you. Just a second. Hold on. Hello? Yeah. No, the first stop sign, take a left. First right. Yeah, by the oak tree. Yeah. Just, yeah, land wherever you're gonna land. Okay. Who's on the phone? What, are you worrying about a telephone call? No, you're worrying about a phone bond with me right now. Come here. Feel it right now. Do you feel the energy? Good. Just a second. Hold on. Hello? Yeah. Right. Yes. Fine. Okay. I'll be here. Goodbye. All right. I'm just gonna tell you one thing. The Dee Dee girl, she's bad. She is so bad for you. Bad. X out. Bad apple. Bad seed. I know. Say it. She is so bad for you. I know. How do I know? Because I've been through it. She's bad for you, and I want you to trust me on this one. Stay clear of her, okay? I got a surprise for you. I got a surprise for you that's gonna just knock your socks off. All right? Stick with me. This is good for you, Frankie. Moondoggy said we have to take special care. Friend, I... Who are you? Count Derek Von Zipper. I'm here to restore love and passion into your simple little life. You are? Of course. My delectable little petite four. Now, you must come with me. I will. I mean, I must. You must. Where are we going? To a place where the calm of night encompasses you in its loving shroud. Never again to feel danger. Never again to feel threatened. Never again to feel anything at all.
know what Moondonkey said. I know. But his neck is just so jugular. We can't do anything Frankie wouldn't want us to do. Speak for yourself. I've just got to have a little taste of him. Sulka, mm. you can't. You know what will happen if Moondoggy finds out. Oh, yeah? What's he going to do? Kill me? What are you girls talking about? Mm, we got a little special bonus in store for you, Frankie Wanky. I better get that. <laughs> You're not getting anything. Except for some of this. Mm. Uh, I really should get that. I'm expecting a very important phone call. No, Frankie. <laughs> Just relax. It won't take very long. I'm going first. <laughs> no, you're not. I'm going first. No way. You went first with Rick. That's because you had Donald and Frank before that. I did not. Yes, you did. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. I did not. You did, too. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. I did not. Yes, you did. I did not. Hello? Oh, oh. hi, Dad. Uh, no. Everything was great. Uh, no, really. I was just on my way out. Uh, what? Yeah, I left the gate open for nacho. Right. Oh, nothing, you know. The usual. Okay, I'll talk to you later. Okay, I love you. I know. Okay. Hello? Oh, thank God, Dr. Van Helsing Meister. I... Yeah, they're still here. Yeah, I think I can get away. I'll meet you at your office in 15 minutes. Okay. Uh... No, I don't, I don't have a major credit card. I just have... I just don't have any credit. Hello? Hello, are you still there? Oh. Uh, okay, uh, thanks, Doctor. Oh, well. We weren't really supposed to have him anyway. Yeah, maybe next time. <sighs> I'm hungry. Spotted guinea pig? Ooh. Oh, thank God you're here. I came as fast as I could. Look, you've got to help me, Dr. Van Helsing Meister. experienced you are in vampire extermination but believe me I'm infested and I really don't have a clue as to how to handle a situation like this I mean my parents are out of town and I had no idea when I let these people in that night that I was letting in a brutal gang of bloodthirsty parasites my parents are gonna kill me uh, no thanks seen them do you just can't imagine well maybe you can I mean, this is all probably old news to you but I mean it's pretty scary stuff to me so doc I'm all ears just tell me what I can do to get rid of these things well the doctor will be with you in an augenblick that's a itty bitty moment
You must be Frankie. Awesome. Shaka, bro, shaka. Who are you? Who do you think I am? The boogeyman? Don't tell me. Dr. Ludwig van Helsingmeister at your service, bud. But call me Kahuna. It's less of a mouthful. You're the big Kahuna? That's me. Ghost chaser, devil hunter, vampire killer, tidal wave rider extraordinaire. Nice resume. Yeah. Uh, why don't you sit down? Uh, sit down, Frankie. Rest your dogs. Uh, do I sense a little tension here? Now, what's all this brouhaha about these bloodsuckers? You didn't get tumbled in a tube, did you? Uh, eat sand, scramble your eggs? What? Hey, don't be pulling my chain, dude. You got vamps in your crib? Vamps in my crib? Listen, Mr. Kahuna, I didn't come here to speak surfer ease with some old third-rate spigoli with beautifully styled hair. Third-rate spigoli? Listen, Bob. Do you know who you're talking to? I come from a long and distinguished line of Van Helsing Meisters who've dedicated every follicle of their beautifully styled hair to the extermination of all those revolting and loathsome creatures from Satan's dominion. I'm not some bogus wannabe looking for Bill Gosey, okay? I'm the real deal. Wait a minute. Van Helsing Meister? Isn't that the name of the vampire killer in Dracula? Yeah, Stoker dropped the Meister, said it didn't roll off the tongue as easy. So you're related to the Van Helsing? Yeah. This is too much. Yeah. Tubular, huh? Well, I suppose you're concerned about my credentials. I've got a PhD in demonology. I've got a master's in occult sciences and a doctorate in exorcism, okay? Well, how do you do in palm readings? Look, bro, if you're gonna insult me, you might as well go play blood bank with your house guests, okay? It's no wax off my stick. Look, I'm sorry. I, I was just expecting someone a little more... mature. No offense. Oh, no, it's cool. I get that all the time. Bum rap. Are you sure they're vamps? Hey, Doc. I saw them suck all the blood out of this guy until there was nothing left. What else could they be? Talent agents? Oh, come on. This is L.A., isn't it? Look, either you're getting serious or I'm walking. Okay, okay. How many are there? Well, there's uh, Count Eric and two girls. Solka and Katrina. Whoa. Babes, um, what do they look like? Uh, I don't know. Uh, two... Beautiful, sexy, voluptuous, scantily clad girls. All right. Did they try to seduce you? Hell yes, but luckily I got away. Why? You gay? No, I... I just didn't want to end up a mixer in some vampire's Bloody Mary mix. All right, right. How many babes did you say? Two. Okay, here's what we do. We wait until tomorrow morning. Catch the little buggers while they're napping. Grab a steak and wham! Right through their little black hearts. Then it's off to the pancake house for some waffles. Piece of cake. Well, you make it sound pretty simple. Hey, no problem. All my family's been doing it for centuries. Well, I've, have you actually ever done it before? What? You mean here in the States? Anywhere. Well, I once sailed into a bat while I was hang gliding in Costa Rica at... Uh, Nailed him. It's not really quite the same thing. Hey, don't get your skivvies in your crack. I know what I'm doing. Well, how can you be so sure? It's my destiny. It's in my blood. Great. Here, check this out. These have been in the family for years. Now, do you want my help or not? Yes, 
I do. I've got a hell of a legacy to fulfill. Otherwise, I'd be on Maui. The surf here sucks. Uh, everything you've ever heard about these blood-sucking fiends is true. Garlic and crosses ward them off. Direct sunlight and a stake through the egg beater kills them. Got it? So all that Dracula stuff really works? Hello. Of course it works, Dodo, or it wouldn't be in the books. I'm going to show you this. Hold this. If you get in real trouble, I want you to use this. Nice enameling, huh? Now, here's what I want you to do. How you been? Hmm? Everything okay? Looks a little sickly. You look a little pale, Frankie. You okay? So where you been, Frankie? Who are all these people? They're my friends, Frankie. Those are my neighbors. What are my neighbors doing here? Surprise, Frankie. <laughs> Bruno, what the hell is going on here? Well, I'm just making nachos for your surprise party. Ay, yay, yay, yay. Who said you could have a party? Now that's gratitude for you. The Count goes through all the trouble of organizing this feast for your surprise party, and this is all the thanks he gets. Well, why would he do a surprise party for me? I don't, I don't get it. Because it's his way of saying thanks for the hospitality. Why, he, you know, he even went through the trouble of, of hiring some strippers and stuff just to give the party a little life. And this is all the thanks he gets. You ought to be ashamed of yourself. Ashamed? You know, what, what are my neighbors doing here? You know what this is about. This is a feast where I don't want my neighbors the main course, right? Oh, uh, here we go. I'm going to kill him. Don't bother. He's already dead. What are you doing with Nacho's hat? <laughs> Bogey, what the hell are you doing? Just party, man. What's up? What's up? Don't you know what's going on here? Yeah, man. Only the most salacious wing ding this town's ever seen. I gotta hand it to you, bro. When you do it, you do it right. Hi, right, girls. <laughs> That's right. Frankie rules. <laughs> Doesn't he, Katrina? Yeah. Totally primo to the max. Oh, my God. Nacho, 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 He's dead! Hey, hey. That means I'm next, right, girl? That's, That's right, right Bogeyman. Bogey, Bogey you got to listen to me. Hello? Frankie's dead. Dad? Uh, hi. Is okay? there any uh, no, everything's great. What's that noise I hear? What? Uh... The noise. The noise? You having a party? Uh, it's, it's just the TV. It's just the TV. Are you having a party? Uh, no, Dad, I'm not having a party. Was Nacho there today? What? 
Uh, uh, yeah, uh, Nacho was here today, yeah. In fact, he's, he's still here. Oh, yeah? All what? Right, so put Nacho on the phone. Uh, oh. Okay. <coughs> My dad says hi. Uh, no, 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 he can't come with the phone. He can't talk now, Dad. Why not? Uh, he's, he's all gone. I mean, well, uh, is he finished? Yeah, he's finished, all right. Uh, okay? All right. Okay. Okay, Mom, okay. I, I love, love you. I love you, okay? Okay, okay. okay. bye. Bye, right bye. Bogey. Bogey. Ah. Yeah, listen, listen. You gotta help me get all these people out of here, okay? Or we can all wind up dead. Great idea, bro! Girls, I'll be right back. Yo, everybody, listen up! Everyone, hold on a sec! Our fearless host, Frankie, over here, has just come up with a totally killer idea. We're all gonna party till we die, all right? <laughs> Yo, Frankie, where are you going? You're gonna miss all the action, man. I need to think. I'm gonna lock myself up in the sauna. Don't bother me. Hey, uh, I wouldn't do that if I were you, bro. You might not like what you find in there. Besides, there's plenty of other chicks in here for you, man. You can have your pick of the litter. What are you talking about? What am I gonna find? It's nothing. I'll catch you later.
Didi? Hi, Frank. Why did you do this? I don't have cable. That's not what I'm talking about. How did all this happen? Well, I tried calling you. And when no one answered the door, I went around the back. And I saw you with those two women. You looked pretty friendly. So I left. when I ran into him. Him who? Moondoggy. What an animal. Yeah. He sure is. He looked in my eyes. And I was spellbound. And he took me in his arms and kissed me with so much passion. I thought I'd die from the way his tongue... Yeah, I get the idea, Titi. Anyway... He invited me to your party. We ended up in your sauna. I saw. Well, my... We made love and... What? And that's all I remember. Do you know what this means? Indeed, I don't know how to tell you this, but you're not one of the living dead. explain this too. Oh my god, Fluffy. No, no. you see, I, I, I gave it a bath and I, I thought the quickest way to dry it was to put it in the microwave. That's all. Listen, Frankie, Frankie, how about those nachos last night, huh? Weren't they the greatest town? You killed my dog! No! Oh, I didn't. Hey, Frankie. Man, you look terrible. Oh, hi, guys. It's so good to see you. Breakfast is going to be a little late this morning. Who the hell are you? I used to work for Pets R Us, but you know what? I'm probably fired now. Oh, 
How you doing, Bogey? Considering I'm dead, I feel pretty good. Ah! Bruno, Bruno, hold on. What did you say we're gonna have for breakfast? Deodorant doesn't. Hey, I have an atomic like a shower. Give me a break. Okay, no, man, that's enough already. Come on, Frank. That's you win. Kids, man. You win. You win. Phew. You promise not to attack. We, we promise. promise. We promise. Let's cross your hearts and hope to die. And scratch that. Will you please shut up? I'm trying to watch television. There's nothing on TV. Oh, Frankie. You know, you've never looked quite so delicious to me as you do right now. Okay, okay. Um, okay. Everybody just. What's going on? Stop! <laughs> you accost our most generous and gracious host. What the hell do you think this is? Breakfast? Silence! Uh, uh. Frankie, it is so nice to see you. I'm so sorry about this. Uh, uh, I gave explicit orders that you were not to be touched. What are you doing awake? I thought you guys all slept during the daytime. Well, that's true. I never been much of a morning person anyway. Oh, not until he's had his first cup of coffee. Oh, Frankie, that's a nice cross. Oh, nice enameling. It's not as nice as this one. Hmm? It was given to me by my good friend, Vlad the Impaler. Vlad always was a sentimentalist. So all that stuff the big kahuna said about vampires, they're not true, love, it's true. The big kahuna? Did you say the big kahuna? No, I didn't say that. Well, then what did you say? You guys were all hungry. I was, I was just gonna offer you guys a big can of tuna. <laughs> nice try, Frankie. Give me a break, man. Please. So, you've been to see the big Kahuna, huh? Listen, you gonna back me up? Cause all I'm doing is backing up. I don't wanna back somebody yeah, up. Well, not today, <sighs> Frankie. I'm afraid I'm gonna have to terminate our relationship. Well, that mean we're not gonna be friends anymore? Oh, I'm afraid not, Frankie. You violated my trust! You violated my girlfriend! Goodbye, Frankie. Wait, just like that? I mean, after all you put me through? Oh, I'm so sorry, Frankie. You're sorry? How did the guy feel? You come in my house, you take over, you eat the gardener? He was named after a chip for Pete's sake. Yeah, yeah. man. I just wish we had more salsa. I was planning on sparing you, Frankie. I mean, you actually seemed hurt last night. Yeah, I was touched. Yeah, we were touched. It touched me. But now? Well, maybe we can work something out. Wait! Uh, I'll wax your coffin every weekend, I'll... Oh, no, shut up! Stop that sucking! Kahuna. Well, it's so nice to see you. It's the Kahuna Ma. Kahuna Meister. Kahuna Meister Rama. With this hammer in his stage. <laughs> Ready to bang? Bang, bang, bang? Will you shut up? Handle this carefully, Frankie. So, Count Eric von Zipper, at last we meet. Well, you can call me Mr. Moondoggy. Not on your life. <laughs> <laughs> shut up! Damn you, Kahuna. You know your family's been a hemorrhoid in my family's ass for centuries? Kiss it goodbye. All right, look. Don't just stand there! Attack! Sorry, boss. You're on your own. You cowards! Frankie. Oh, dear 
dear, dear Frankie, isn't this something you can do? Sorry, but uh, you've abused the code of good guest conduct. How so, my friend? Look what you did to my girlfriend. I gave you two of mine. They were gonna rip my throat and I was gonna die a horrible, bloody, brutal death. Kahuna, could you please just get this over with? Sorry, dude. This is your last wave. You just hang tin. You'll be wiped out before you know it. <laughs> Why are you stopping? Unreal. Did Bruno make breakfast yet? Solka, Katrina. Solka, Katrina, it is so good to see you. I'd like you to meet our new friend, Dr. Ludwig van Helsingmeister. Helsing. Helsing. Helsingmeister. Ludwig Helsingmeister. The doctor. Please call me Kahuna, ladies. Helsingmeister. Friend. Hmm. Girls. Take uh, the kahuna to our room and uh, show him a good time. All right. Thanks, Boondoggy. You're okay. Oh, oh, it's my pleasure. So glad we could uh, work this out without any bloodshed. Girls, he's all yours. Do we have to show special care? No, 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 no. Not this time, no. Go. Enjoy. What are you doing? Sorry, Frankie. Did you see? Did. Oh, no. No. <laughs> Look what you've done. They're gone. Did anybody order a spotted guinea pig? Oh, man. I must have fallen asleep after we partied, dude. Sorry. Hey, do those babes ever show up? What babes? Here's my card. Call me if you need me. Okay. I will. Oh. Kahuna, man. What was he doing here? Oh, man. What was all this business about getting rid of Moondoggy? What happened to Moondoggy? Moondoggy? Who's Moondoggy?